Welcome to the 6th lesson of Osio Robot Car V2 Kit. In this lesson, we will connect robot car to Wi-Fi and use an app to control the car through internet. This is a typical Internet of Things IoT, application. Step 1, Hardware Installation. Please prepare all parts as above shows. You must complete Lesson 1, Lesson 4 and Lesson 5 framework before you continue on with this lesson. The Osio Wi-Fi Shield is shipped with jumper caps. One jumper cap connect D4 to B underscore TX, and other jumper cap connect D5 to B underscore RX. If you find that the jumper caps don't connect this pins, please insert the jumper caps personally. Please remove all connection on Osio Uno board, and then insert to Osio Wi-Fi shield onto your Uno board. Connect SG90 servo motor, Osio Model X motor driver module and Osio Wi-Fi shield as connection graph. Connect 5 PCs tracking sensor modules to Osio Wi-Fi shield as connection graph. Connect ultrasonic sensor to Osio Wi-Fi shield as connection diagram. Connect buzzer module with Osio Wi-Fi shield as connection diagram. Connect E underscore TX pin to D5 and E underscore RX pin to D4 of Osio Wi-Fi shield as per diagram. Step 2, Check Wiring. Copy the code from www.osio.com slash driver slash l6test.ino and paste in Arduino IDE. Connect Uno R3 board to PC with USB cable and choose Arduino slash Hanuino Uno as board, and choose your own port, then upload this project. After turning on the car, the car will move forward for 2 seconds, backward for 2 seconds, turn left for 2 seconds, right for 2 seconds and then stop. If the car does not move in above mentioned scenario, please check your wiring. Step 3, STA mode testing. Download Wi-Fi ESP master library from www.osio.com slash driver slash Wi-Fi ESP master zip. Download code from Osio and then unzip this file, and you will get a folder called V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A. Open the Arduino IDE, click Sketch, click Include Library, click Add. Zip Library, then load Wi-Fi ESP master.zip file into Arduino. Connect Arduino Uno to PC with USB cable, open Arduino IDE, click File, click Open, and then choose code V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A.ino in V2 Smart Car Lesson 6A folder, load the code into Arduino. 
replace the 100th line of the code your underscore router underscore SSID with your router Wi-Fi SSID. Replace the 102nd line of the code your underscore router underscore Wi-Fi underscore password with Wi-Fi password. Choose Arduino slash Henuino Uno as board, and choose your own port, and then upload the sketch to your board. Click Serial Monitor window in upper right corner of Arduino IDE and you will see connected to your router Wi-Fi SSID and the IP address of your car. Go to Google Play or Apple App Store and search Osio Wi-Fi Robot, and download and install the app Osio Wi-Fi Robot Car. Please confirm that your phone connect the same Wi-Fi router and then open the app. Click settings and enter the IP address of your car, and then click connect. Now, you can control your car by Wi-Fi. Click direction keys to control robot car by manual and click middle key to stop movement. Click obstacle key to control robot car by moving avoidance obstacle. Click tracking key to control robot car by moving along black track. Step 4, AP Mode Testing Download code from OSIO and then unzip this file, and you will get a folder called V2 Smart Car Lesson 6B. Connect Arduino Uno to PC with USB cable, open Arduino IDE, click File, click Open, and then choose code V2 Smart Car Lesson 6B.ino in V2 Smart Car Lesson 6B folder, load the code into Arduino. Check whether you have loaded Wi-Fi ESP Master Library. If not, please follow step 3 to loaded Wi-Fi ESP Master Library at first. Choose Arduino slash Henuino Uno as board, and choose your own port, and then upload the sketch to your board. Click Serial Monitor window in upper right corner of Arduino IDE and you will see the IP address, 192.168.4.1 Click Settings of your phone, then click on Setting, then choose Osio Robot as a network Open app Osio Wi-Fi Robot Car and you will see connected to Osio Robot. Click Settings, then enter 192.168.4.1 as IP address, then click Connect. Now, you can control your car. Click Direction Keys to control robot car by manual and click Middle Key to stop movement. Click Obstacle key to control robot car by moving avoidance obstacle. Click tracking key to control robot car by moving along black track.